Get ready to explore and play with Elliot. Hi, I'm Laurie from TTPM. This first coding robot from Elenco is ideal for ages three and up and will follow instructions given to him moving forward, left, and right to reach a desired destination. I'll tell you how it works in a second, but first, make sure to click subscribe for even more fun STEM toys. So along with Elliot, spelled E-L-10-T, by the way, you get a control panel and 20 blocks. Preschoolers give Elliot instructions by placing these directional, light, and sound blocks into the control panel, programming up to 12 steps. When the sequence is ready, place Elliot's helmet on the control panel and press the go button. When the green light stops flashing, the transfer is complete. Turn on Elliot, replace his helmet, and press the orange button on his chest to make a move. To start off, just experiment with different block combinations to see what Elliot does. And then progress to the 16 double-sided mission cards that give detailed routes to take or destinations to reach on the double-sided map. There are three mission card difficulty levels, and at the advanced stage, add in some of the roadblock accessories for Elliot to avoid. This also includes a sticker sheet that I don't think has anything to do with the toy aside from being something that kids can use to decorate Elliot or other things, such as the toy's box as my kid did. You will need seven AA batteries in order to start playing with Elliot right out of the box. This is for ages three and up, but adults will need to help young kids read through the instruction booklet. The mission cards are picture-based though. As with any preschool programming toy, little kids will think it's really cool to see the robot perform the moves they programmed. With my four-year-old daughter, it was less about the programming and sequencing of the blocks and more about just watching the robot do anything. Parent participation is definitely going to be necessary with the youngest kids in order to attempt to engage the kids in the mission cards. And parents may need to help younger kids get the helmet on and off. I think slightly older kids will take to solving the missions and creating their own programs a little better. But overall, this is a fun and cute hands-on introduction to STEM concepts. What do you guys think? Who else is looking for preschool STEM toys? Let me know in the comments. The pros are the ease of programming, the fun of watching Elliot move, and the hands-on introduction to STEM for young kids. The cons are that no batteries are included, but I give this toy four stars. For where to buy and current prices, visit TTPM and subscribe to our YouTube channels for more reviews every day.